Hi everybody, it's Malik again on his channel. How to open command prompt before logging into Windows. Today we will look at four ways to open a command prompt before entering Windows 11, Windows 10, and Windows 8. There are several reasons why you might want a command prompt outside the system, and one of them, if you forgot your account password and now you want to fix this problem. Perhaps your Windows does not boot, and you need to restore the operating system using the command prompt. Method number one. On your keyboard, press and hold the shift key, and then click here and restart your computer. The main menu of System Recovery Program opened before us. Click Troubleshoot. Then Advanced Options. Now press Command Prompt. This was the first way to open a command prompt. Method number two. If your system asks for a password to open a command prompt, you need to connect a Windows 7, 8, Windows 10, or Windows 11 installation USB flash drive to your computer, or you can also use a Windows installation DVD. Usually, using such a bootable USB flash drive or DVD disk, Windows is installed on the computer. Whether your version of Windows is home or pro, any edition of Windows will work to reset your password. Connect this USB flash drive or Windows DVD to your computer and restart your computer. Immediately after the start of the reboot, continuously press a certain key on the keyboard to bring up the boot menu. I press the F12 key. For you it could be F8, F9, F11, F12, or some other key. There is no single standard and different computers may have different keys to call the boot menu. The boot menu opens, find the installation USB flash drive or DVD in the boot menu, press enter. The Windows installation menu will open, but we will not install anything, just press shift and F10 at the same time. And the command line immediately opened. Method number three. The first few steps of method three are exactly the same as in method two. We boot the computer from the Windows installation USB flash drive or Windows DVD and wait for the Windows installation menu to open. But we will not install Windows here either. Next, in the menu we will click Repair your computer. The automatic system recovery program has opened. Click Troubleshoot. Now press Command Prompt. A command prompt opened, and that was method number three. Method number four. On your keyboard, press and hold the shift key, and then click here and restart your computer. And after the system boot window appears, where white dots rotate in a circle, immediately press the button, reset, to force restart the computer before entering the system. When the computer restarts, just force restart it again in the same way. To force restart the laptop, after the appearance of white dots rotating in a circle, immediately press the button, turn on, and hold until the laptop turns off. Then turn on the laptop and do the same again. If your desktop computer does not have a reset button, after turning on the computer, just like on a laptop, press the button, turn on, and hold it until the computer turns off. Due to a different BIOS configuration, it is possible that instead of white dots rotating in a circle, the Windows logo will appear on your screen. Then you immediately force restart your computer or laptop. Forcibly restart your computer or laptop two to three times, and a white font will appear on your screen. This is the system recovery program being loaded. The automatic system recovery program has opened, Click here. The main menu of System Recovery Program opened before us. Click Troubleshoot. Then Advanced Options. Now press Command Prompt. This was the fourth way to open the command prompt. I hope that one of these four ways will help open the command prompt and solve your problem. Please share this video with someone. Have a nice day, everyone.